Howdy folks, Redneck Chuck here. Back again because it seems as though some of you folks have been asking about me. I appreciate it. Just figured I'd come back and update you on my life and whatnot. I'm proud to say that me and the missus are going to be expecting us a new youngin here soon. This will make number six for us. Now, I know what you're thinking. I don't look old enough to have six kids. Well, me and Miss Linda Lou, we're going to be celebrating our 25th wedding anniversary this here January. And then a few days after, it's going to be my 45th birthday. Now, folks ask me all the time, Chuck, how do you look so young? Hell, that's an easy one. Love. Well, folks, it's been damn near three years since I showed my face on this here tube of you. So I thought I'd revisit some of my old topics that I used on the first video that I was in. In a little segment I like to call... What the Chuck? How's your mom and them? Dad's gonna be pissed. Oh, you buck wild. What the Chuck? First thing I'd like to say is I need to apologize to anybody who has anything to do with So You Think You Can Dance. Now, I didn't know much about your style and your way of life at the time of my last video, so about two years ago I decided to uh, check it out and take a peek into it see what it was all about. Now I ain't got any video but I do got some pics. I tried to even do my own style as much like yours as I could even wear my shiny sparkly flannel shirt for the occasion. Here's me with Steven Boss or aka Twitch as you all know him. We're throwing up the season four sign that they always did. This is Gav Manu, Manu. I don't know how to say your name Gav. I'm sorry buddy. This is the lovely Miss Carrington Payne. Boy, Linda Lou would have kicked my ass if she'd seen how big I was smiling. I was giddy like a schoolgirl. And here's the winner of the whole shebang, Mr. Joshua Allen. Boy, that man can dance a jig like none other. I gotta tell you, those folks put on one hell of a show. So the next time you're outside and you hear one of them cars with a boombox bouncing down the street, take a few seconds and cut a rug. Hell, I even do it from time to time. I like to call it my 10 second breakdown. Now, on to Paris Hilton. So it seems that Little Miss Press got busted with some cocaine in Las Vegas, and she's now doing community surface just like all the other junkies on Hollywood Boulevard. <laughs> that picture kills me. <laughs> she looks good in yellow. <laughs> Maybe yellow's the new pink. Now, I find it odd that it has been three years since my first video, and Lindsay Lohan is still in rehab. You'd think she'd learn by now. Even her dad's joined her for a little bit of time in there. <laughs> She's at the Betty Ford Clinic, which I bet when she got in, they welcomed her. She said she was very excited to recover, especially at the Betty Ford Clinic, because it always was her favorite golden girl. Also, her mom's been making a fuss about this new Glee episode that was on, saying that Gwyneth Paltrow's character, who played a Spanish teacher, asked, Lindsay Lohan's crazy, isn't she? She said that it was tasteless. Dina, I'm glad you're letting us know what tasteless is, because your whole family has their shit together. Maybe you guys should just go off in a rehab of your own, far away from anybody else, for just a few years. I think it might make things a little bit better for everyone else involved. So I tried to find something about Britney Spears, but couldn't find anything. It turns out that Perez Hilton said something about her getting her own reality TV show, so I decided to check it out on Britney's official site, and she said, and I quote, bullshit. So really, there's nothing going on with her, so it seems as though she might be on a good road in a great direction, so, uh, you know, more power to you. I love seeing you starlets get your ducks in a row. All right, now I could go into this whole Jersey Shore rant, but I don't think that there is enough time on a YouTube video to condense that much. So maybe another time. Anyway, I'd like to thank y'all for watching me again jabber on about random information. The best of wishes to you and yours. All right, Dan, what's Chuck? Updates. Miss. Was it right in my eye? No, it was on your couch. Though. Redneck Chuck's gonna be a daddy. Again. We started pumping out kids when she was about 17. <laughs> so, uh, that's probably a bad thing to say, isn't it? <laughs> I was one of she was 17. <laughs> we had our first child when she was 17. He is, how old would that make him? 
25. <laughs> yeah. Little Chris, you'll probably meet him on down the road somewhere. <laughs> it was creeping up my teeth. <laughs> I thought that car had boombox beat, and I was like, oh my god, that would be perfect, I bet. <laughs> what do you think, good? Mm -hmm.